What's good, J Penny Gang? It's your girl, J Penny, here, and I'm back again with another freaking vlog video or video vlog, whatever. However, however it go. I'm back again with another freaking daily vlog. You know what I'm saying? I'm back in, I'm back on the cut. That's why I had to <laughs> Um, I got a couple of events coming up for you guys that I'm going to record for shizzle my nizzle. I'm going to record for y'all. Got a couple of events. I ain't going to tell y'all because I don't want to spoil it. And y'all going to be like, dang, I don't even need to watch that because I already know how that went. So I ain't going to spoil all that. So I ain't going to tell y'all. You know what I'm saying? But it's now going on 425 right now. And... It's a Thursday, May 16th. It's close to Friday. Like, I am so ready for the weekend. When I say I'm ready for the weekend, bro, I'm ready for the freaking weekend. Because I need to go grocery shopping. So, it's like, yeah, I like to really grocery shop on a weekend. Yeah, I got my um niece birthday coming up. She's turning big 17. But I don't think she's doing anything for her birthday. Just because her behavior and her, you know what I'm saying, her school her grades, I guess, her behavior and grades. So I don't think she's really, I know she's not getting anything, but I wonder if she gonna at least have a cape. Hopefully she, for sure she has a cape. Because when it comes to parties and stuff, I'm down for some cape, I'm down. So that's why I get really more excited when when people birthdays in the family be coming up because that's what I'm saying for, it's a cape. It's the cake. Like, go ahead. Y'all can call me. Oh, you fat for some cake. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Like, your girl can eat when it comes to food or especially desserts. And your girl currently at work. For all of y'all that are new to my channel, I am a custodian, or as y'all would say, as a janitor. But we go by custodian. So, yeah, call us a C word, not the J word. I'm about to just bring y'all in my life for a day. I'm about to get ready to start cleaning my classroom. Summer school custodian, by the way. All right, you guys, so I'm out of my office finally, and I'm in my first classroom, but guess how much trash I had to pull out from all of these classrooms? Like, it's never been this much. Like, out of all these classrooms that I clean, it never been this much. Usually I have like one bag each day, but look at this. Four bags and a couple boxes. Like, that's how you know these teachers are trying to clean out for the next year. But, uh, yeah. This, um, first classroom ain't too bad. It ain't too bad, you know what I'm saying? Something slight. Yeah, it ain't too, it ain't, you know what I'm saying? Y'all know what I mean, right? It ain't too bad in here. Table still look clean, floor still look clean. Yeah, I don't really got to do much in here. Or do I? Or do I? What is that? What is that? What is that? But yeah, I think I'm just mopping here. You know what I'm saying? So I'm gonna do this off camera because y'all know how I go. I get distracted when the camera is on. So I'm gonna do this off camera. Six hours later. All right, you guys, as you can see, I am on my little lunch break. Taking a break, you know what I'm saying? Gotta get your break in and stuff. And I'm about to finish the rest of my subway that I got earlier. I don't even know why I got some salt and vinegar chips, knowing that I really don't like these. These are not my favorite chips, so don't take it as that. Like, I normally wouldn't eat these. I just picked it up because I saw it. Like my eyes catches a lot of things. I just, I just grab it, you know. But yeah, I don't know why I grabbed that flavor because it's not my favorite. But I got me a sub from Subway, as I told y'all earlier. And yeah, this junk is spicy. So all y'all that like the spicy, you know what I'm saying? I'm with y'all. I love spicy. I love spicy. I love hot sauce, jalapenos, anything hot. I like it. I just, I, ooh, 
I just love spicy like yes and this right here this sub right here that I got is super spicy not super spicy but yeah it got some jalapenos on it and it got some um, garlic garlic roasted sauce some 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 type of garlic sauce but which is good though it's good you know but the only thing is I don't really care for tomato I mean not tomatoes but cucumbers I don't really care for spinach. Like, I hate the strings that be on spinach. Because they're just like, ugh. It's like, what the freak is this? But, yeah. That mug busting, bro. When I say that mug busting, it's busting. Mmm. I got me some water. I don't got nothing to drink here. Like I said, I gotta go grocery shopping. So stay tuned for that vlog. But I'm gonna give y'all like a little bit of Q of a QA. Not just like a no regular basic QA. Not like a like a like a how old are you type thing. It's like a like a spicy QA, you know? What embarrassed you the most? That's a hard question. Cause a lot of things. Well not I'm gonna say a lot of things embarrass me. But I can't think at, at this point. I can't. I can't. I don't know. Ah. I, I don't know. I can't think at this point of what embarrassed me. Maybe if I come to my mind later, I'll tell y'all. But next question. What is your love language? This question, I never really. Well, I never really experienced my. You know what I'm saying? I never really experienced my love language. But if I had to say, I say it's. Mm, I I really don't know, cause you, if you haven't experienced it, how you supposed to answer? I'm gonna just go with touching. I don't know. I don't know. I'm gonna just go with touching. It it got it gotta be touching. It gotta be touching. Let's just leave it right there. Next question is, where do you want to be? In five years from now, or 10 and 15, that's what to say. Uh, where do I want to be is, to be real with y'all, I really don't even know. I don't even know. I don't even know where I want to be right now. I don't know. I don't know. Right now, I'm just in my city, just, you know what I'm saying, just hustling, making money. Getting that bread and that's it. I, but I, to be to be real with you, I really don't know. I don't. Have you ever been bullied in high school? Bullied? Bullied? No. No, I never been bullied in high school because everybody that I knew we was, you know, what I'm saying everybody in the high school I was cool with. It wasn't no beef, no none of that. Next question is, do you want to have kids one day? If so, how many? Now this one, I get asked a lot. I get asked a lot on this question, do I want to have kids? And the answer to that is, mm, no, no and yes. No and yes. Hold on, because is there too much lightning? Okay, but yeah, okay, yeah, so. The answer to that question is no and yes. I say no because, I mean, I don't know. I don't know. Because I've, I've been, had my experience before with kids. And it's just like, ooh, this not going to work out. Because first of all, mm, this, gonna, this might sound funny to y'all, but... When it comes to me having my own snacks, baby, ooh, I'm not gonna wanna share. So it's just like, what's the point of having this kid? Like, you gotta share everything with them. You can't have nothing to yourself. And you know what I'm saying? You know, y'all gotta have y'all snacks, you know what I'm saying? Anytime you're on your cycle, or you just, you know what I'm saying? You just wanna create snacks. So, yeah, you know, when you have a child, you, you, you can't, you know what I'm saying, have nothing to yourself. Unless you specifically told them no. No, you can't have no. But 
on the other hand, if I do have kids, it's not coming out of this punani. <laughs> or look, let me reverse that back. If I do have kids, it's not coming out of my body. It's not coming out of my body. What you thought this was? Cause first of all, I'm not, no bro. I'm not taking no pain, no time bro. No pain bro. The only pain I'm getting is that cramps. You know what I'm saying? Stomach cramps, maybe thigh cramps, but never no, no pain pain. You know? No, ain't nothing about to be, I'm not even about to go in detail bro. The answer just no, ain't nothing coming out of this body. If I did want to have kids, I always told myself I'm going to the, uh, what is it called, the foster care, and I'm going there. That's what I always told myself as a kid. Well, not a kid, not a kid kid, but you know what I'm saying, like a teenage thing. You know what I'm saying, like, yeah. That's what I always told myself. If I, if I always want to have a kid, I'm going straight to foster care. Real talk. What's the worst you ever been physically hurt. Now, I ain't gonna lie, I don't know what physically mean, but um, I've been hurt before, but not like, not like a, a, a broken leg hurt. I've been hurt like I cut myself, I cut my thumb right here when I was like, uh, when I think when I was like eight, was I eight or 10? Anyways, I cut my thumb and I had to get stitches, but I did it on purpose purposely because my stupid self thought like oh I'm gonna get out of school by cutting my thumb you know what I'm saying getting stitches and stuff but obviously that didn't work but yeah I cut my thumb twice on the same thumb of cutting my um cutting through my skin with a freaking can opener or not a can opener a freaking can good one of those cans of foods got the little got the silver lid and went like um something like that, you know what I'm saying? And yeah, just blood just started gushing out and everything. And then you could see my meat. No diddy, but you could see the meat. But yeah. That's how I got hurt before. That's the only thing. Oh or, or when I was a childhood, I scraped my knee. But that's every childhood. You know what I'm saying? If you didn't if if no kid didn't scrape their knee, you didn't have a good childhood. That's how I think of it. You didn't have a good childhood. I scraped my knee, stayed on top of the dirty clothes basket, trying to play black, trying to play uh, ghetto basketball outside. Because we had our dirty clothes basket, you know the little hamster, right? I turned it upside down, you know what I'm saying? And I put a mop bucket hanging up on the house, and I played basketball. Hey, and then I fell off the basket and hurt my knee. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. The dirty bas the dirty clothes hamster was outside because you know back in the day when I was little, my mom she she liked to hang her clothes outside on the line. I mean I like it. Ain't nothing wrong with hanging your clothes outside on the line. I mean it's fresh air. But me personally, I rather just throw my clothes in the dryer because I'm just lazy. But yeah. Next question is, have you ever been in love? Of course. Of course. Like, what type of question is that? Now, we ain't gonna get into deep, but the answer to, to that is yes, of course. Next question is, who was your very first crush? Oh my gosh, bro, y'all want me to spill the tea? Hold on, let me take a bite on this. My very first crush was a boy. His name was, his name started with a K. It, this was back in middle school. I don't even know. I don't even know why I liked it him. Because till this day, he look ugly now. Back in middle school, he had a freaking oval head shaped like an egg. Like what? Bruh. These taste different unless, I don't know.
these mugs taste different. They ain't the same. They don't got all that vinegar and salt on them for real. Unless it's just the jalapenos still sitting on my tongue. Two hours later. All right, y'all. So it's going on 8, 17, 18, maybe. And I got caught up doing some TikToks. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, it's going on 8, 18 right now. Like I said, I got caught up doing some TikToks. When I tell y'all, when I get on TikTok, I stay on there for the longest. And I gotta hurry up and clean my bathrooms because, baby, my shit about to end. And these bathrooms, if these bathrooms are not clean, they gonna be on me bad. They're gonna be like, oh, that floor ain't bathrooms, ain't, it's not clean. Like, oh no, like, one thing about me, baby, my floor gonna stay clean. So let me go clean these bathrooms. My bathroom ain't that bad, but. You know what I'm saying? I'ma just go, you know what I'm saying? Swoop de doop de clean it up a little bit. And you know what I'm saying? Make it smell nice and fresh. So fresh and so clean, clean. Hold on, cause I know I don't hear my song. All I want to do is spin it, but God said he gonna rank it up. Later. Bro, why is it not on door mode? We back. We back and we better. We better than ever. I don't know why that volume is on with each other. I don't know what I said. But man, it's hot, man. It's real hot. See what I told y'all? I gotta put on lip gloss every five minutes. Because my lips always drying out. That's only when I eat, drink, you know what I'm saying? It's just always dry out. But that one song stuck in my head. Uh, 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 I'm gonna do me with love. Uh huh, he says, he guys. I don't know, I'll be honest, song something's in my head, no one I really don't listen to. Her. But I really don't know, you know? But what I do know, mm, is I'm gonna listen to some, 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 some music. He grips and he grinds, he grips and he grinds. Where is my phone, dog? Where my phone, dog? You tripping, hey, phone! Phone. Oh, heck you know. Phone. Have y'all seen my phone? Am I tripping? On my phone. Now I gotta call my phone, yo. I can't even call my phone. Bro, where the freak I put my phone, cuz? Hold on. Hold on.
Oh no. We about to fight. Put my phone up. Bro, this is about to make me mad. This is about to make me mad because where's my phone? Real talk. Where the freak is my phone? I don't play with my phone! <sighs> I'm going through it right now. I done lost my phone. Where did my phone go? I just had it! I can't even find my phone, dog. It's about to make me mad. I can't find my phone. I'm about to be mad. I'm about to be so mad, bro, because I can't find my phone, bro. I don't know where did my phone go. I'm mad, bro. I'm mad, cause I can't find my phone, and I don't play up on my phone. I can't even vibe to no freaking music, cause I don't got my freaking phone. I just had it, swear to God, bro. Swear to God, please help me find my phone. This is about to make me mad. This is really about to make me mad. Y'all about to help me find my phone. I can't even vibe in the car. No, I'm mad. I'm mad. I'm mad. Cause where my phone at, bro? Where my phone, bro. Where my phone off. Oh my, where did I put my phone off? See, this is why it's hard keeping up with a camera and two phones. Cause, cause why? Cause why, dog? I just had it, bro. I gotta be in the car somewhere, bro. Cause I just seen it. Oh. Look, look at that. Look at that. How did my phone fall between the seat? How did it fall between the seat? I got it. So, our shift almost about to end, but, but I want to say like 15 more minutes. So, I'm going to do some TikToks, and then I guess I'll get back with y'all. I was going to do like a little play, lit playlist in the car, but I got so upset about, you know what I'm saying, losing my phone. And I was about to be so freaking mad, bro. I don't play about my phone, but... 
I see I lost that like can't even listen to no lit playlist in the car. I was about to get heated just because I lost my phone. But if I don't end this video right now, I'm gonna end this video at home. So tomorrow I won't have my vlog camera because of my sister. You wanna use it. I don't know what for. Hopefully, I, of course it's probably to like record or take pictures. But yeah. Hopefully she record since I won't be able to record for my nephew's um, prom. Because I wish I could see his prom, but at the same time I got work. And yeah, money comes first. So yeah. So I guess I'm, yeah, I'm going to just end this video right here. You know what I'm saying? Until next time, J Penny Gang Real is out the same. Peace out, your girl is out. Ooh, let that money talk. Yeah. Let that money talk I said ooh let that money talk